They should be. We said nine, didn't we? Um, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I, I feel a little bit anxious. Is that weird? What are you laughing? Why? I don't know. It's been a year and I'm just, I, feel, I still feel really drained and it's, do I look okay? Like, what? Yeah, yeah. You look, oh, I look all right for you. You look tree. amazing. Make sure you take care of my car, all right? Sure, boss. <sighs> I thought I said take care of my friggin' car. How are you? Hello. I see you're moving up in the world. Yeah, of course. You know me. It's how we roll. Live and die, bro. Right, yeah. brother? <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's it. It's been um, yeah, not much. Uh, oh, I quit my job at uh, McD. Huh? There's just really? too, much, yeah, too much stress behind the counter and things. Yeah. Oh. And Scotty, man, your grandfather's out in these businesses. All the fun stuff. Yeah, cool. <laughs> cool. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. So, you guys, um, want to drink? Hey, you may want to say clear of him. He just got out. He used to work at a petrol station nearby and till he went funny in the air. Sorry, but, but what do you mean by just got out? So, do you have anything worked out for the guys? What? Oh, shush, sure? sure. don't say it here. They're right there. I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, 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 Alice and I worked everything really? out. Yeah. Really? Okay. Don't stress, it's gonna be good. <laughs> you did good. Cool, because I spent a week what? trying to figure out the whole game. Yeah, I know you said that, but don't worry. It's going to be awesome. Three, three cokes, thanks. Keep the change. What, the trip? Yeah, because it's been yeah. a year since we've caught up as a group. And yeah, I know. I thought about that as well. Mm. Well, um, I yeah. guess if the fates allow, it's going to be a one killer holiday. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, Maybe he doesn't talk. I do. 
Hey! Tate, I'm talking to you! Oh, shit! He doesn't speak, he's mute. If you kids want anything, talk to us, right? So what do you want? Make it quick. We was about to nap back there. Yeah, we just wanted to come and collect our cabin keys. Yeah, we're just here to check in. Ah, all paid in full? Yeah, of course. Right, yeah. Yeah, uh, looks all right. Now listen, there's only one key. Don't lose it. And don't you kids make too much mess or noise at night, yeah? Yeah? And don't even think about stealing stuff. You know what we did to the last lot, did you know? oh, oh. We get it. We'll be good. Mostly. <laughs> <laughs> No, we're just fucking with you. Your room should be nearly ready. Amy, the cleaner's up there. Now go on. Get out of here before we change our minds. Yeah, yeah. Point made. Let's get a move on. No reason to stop right now, right? Looks like someone's needing a holiday more than us. No, no. Yeah. Actually found this place. Uh, it was Tim's recommendation. The rest of us have been too busy to suggest that. Uh, yeah, the ads never say if the caretakers are going to be freaks or not. <laughs> well, I hope this cabin's going to be worth it, Tim. Well, well. Well, at least we're not going to be staying anywhere near those weird people. Yeah, no shit. Caretaker, anyway. Oh my god. Oh, be damned. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello. You must be the new visitors. Your cabin is spotless. Enjoy your stay. It's so peaceful and serene out here. Thanks. Thanks. Bye. Bye. <laughs> oh, nice of you to join us. Some of us want to have a little uh, alone time. Well, there are two bedrooms here. Right, I'll be damned. Okay, uh, I think I should establish a few things I brought just in case of security. Security? Yeah. I bought us this uh, motion sensor. Pretty handy for when we sleep at night. And, of course, my father's gun. Oh, what? Scott, is any of that really necessary? Yeah. You never know what you're gonna run into when in the bush. <sighs> or oh, maybe if the caretaker comes after you with his rifle. No, I'm serious. <laughs> you never know. Look, I'll just hide them both over here. Right? So if anything, they're there. All, right. All this serious shit. Who's up for a spa, huh? Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> Come on, you coming in here or what? It feels amazing. Oh. Come here, there's plenty of room over here on my lap. <laughs> Come here. All right. Would you lift it? Actually, I've got a suggestion. What? Why don't you all come over here? There's a warm spot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
I'm joking! I'm joking! Are you serious? I'm joking! You okay, Tom? Yeah, I'm all right. I'm all good. Just go that way, don't come closer to me. Which way is that way? This way, yeah. Stop moving, Actually, no, that's good. Stay there, I've got a good spot here. You've got all the room! Going for a bit of nostalgia. I wouldn't wreck it like that far back. But hey, look, we're not kids anymore. Just glad we're all here having a drink. Uh, well, not everybody. You guys know who we're missing, right? Who? Oh. Eddie. <sighs> Tim, what happened to him again? I don't know. When I asked him to come, he said he had other stuff. Oh, well. It's always fun, I can't make it. Well, I think there was something else that happened like months back. Scott, you would know about it, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I was hoping I could say this like a campfire ghost story. No, 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 no. Just kidding. Look, I ran into him a couple months back in the hospital. Hospital? It wasn't much. I was bringing my mum there for a checkup. While waiting, I went and visited Eddie. He was in bed. His head was banged up. Look nasty. I asked the doctor. He said Eddie was recovering from a car accident. That's all I know. Wait, you knew him best out of all this, right? Not anymore, I'm afraid. Okay, well, here's to Eddie. Get to join us on our next outing. Well, what's next? All right, we'll play on each other's voice. Mm. What's up? Um, well, when obviously Tim suggested the trip last month, we girls in private thought about planning a little game for you guys. Oh, game? Oh my god, please tell me a strip poker. It's like a treasure hunt, right? So, alright, remember when we were all chatting online and we couldn't decide who was gonna hang out with who? Well, the game's just for that. Look guys, the objective is we go into the bush and lay some clues out, mm -hmm. where you guys start in separate places, follow our clues, which ultimately determines which one of us you'll get to hang with for the rest of the trip. Or, not at all. <laughs> As in... Well, okay, so the game's got many variables, but obviously only three outcomes, but one will be a dead end. Yeah. Meaning one of you guys won't get a girl. <laughs> Look, things just aren't true when all of us are winners. <laughs> and why can't we decide this all over like a game of poker or something? No, why would we drive all the way out here to not even do the same thing? This is going to be really unique. Yeah. The lady's got a point. Yeah, hang on, but you girls have planned and mapped all this out already. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Well. I'm game. <laughs> what about you lot? Yeah, I'm cool. Let's do it. <laughs>
What about? What? It's just the end of my cape is all. I'm pretty sure you saw this one coming. <laughs> yeah, but uh, they were different girls. I didn't realize you were hitting on Arlene now. <laughs> Scott doesn't have something like that planned up his sleeve, does he? Jeez, you are slow, Tim. Aren't you, mate? You know what? That's one thing I've always loved about you. <laughs> All right, men, as we discussed, time to give him up. In all honesty, this doesn't sound very necessary. Oh, <laughs> and what if you guys try to cheat? Hmm? Well, Not a chance. It's not happening. Wait, what happens if one of us gets lost? We figured that out already. Yeah. yeah. Tim, just go east on the compass, way deeper into the woods until you reach a huge lake, and then keep going east again. What happens if you're wrong? You can trust us, Scott. Yeah, exactly. Anyway, time limit is one hour, and if you haven't found either of us girls by then, game over. Yes, I'm <laughs> Alright, any more questions, man? Nope. Yeah. Which way's east? No. Um, oh, really, yeah. Tim? I just said go east on the compass. Yeah, go go far, east, but yeah. the compass is moving. It's really pretty out here. Yeah, it's wonderful. A bit of fun for your house? Yeah. Okay, just it on. You ready? Yeah. It's play time. Here's your instructions. <laughs> okay. Um. Jacket. Bag. Thanks. Am I going to run into either like Mike or Scott out here? Well, maybe, yeah. If you happen to reach certain points at certain times. Could oh, happen. Okay. Just the thought of being out here. Alone. <laughs> oh, Tim, please, come on, you're a grown-up, you'll manage, you'll be fine, okay? Okay. Oh, 2 p.m., right on time. Okay, have fun. Don't right. get lost. What? I am very necessary. Come on, it's going to be fun. So here you are, as you requested, handsome. What would I do without you? Oh, you'd be lost like a little baby. Mm -hmm. Just find me in half an hour so we have more time together, okay? Sure. So, uh, we'll have to go through all of this. Why don't we just do it here? I thought you made it easier for you, you moron. <laughs> so, did you just reach clues for Tim? Yes, I did. We're going around in circus by hours. I can't believe you talked me into doing that shit. What? Well, it's the only way that I'll end up on your route. I don't want Andy or Morales. I want you, baby. No! <laughs> Look, it's just a game. Tim knows not to take it too hard. I mean, Andrew already said that, right? <laughs> Fine, all right. Well, I'll see you later in the bush. <laughs> made this hard, yeah? Alright, well you did make it hard. Fast go. Okay.
the fifty meters east. What the hell? Okay, maybe save this for later, I guess. Fucking assholes! What the hell? Look to the lab, don't you think, Ellis? Nine. Took a while longer than I thought you would. You know, I gotta ask, did you have to go through all of my clothes? Alice?
Alice! Alice, damn it! Fuck, what happened? Alice. Oh! Alice, I'll get help. Try and get you out, okay? <laughs> Maybe, um... Oh. Right, I think I've got it. You gotta stop struggling. <laughs> Hang on! Uh, stop struggling! <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, holy shit! You do kind of have a thing for Mike Ben, huh? Well, that's just it. Back then I said, yeah, that's why I go for the trip, but now I'm not so sure. I know what you mean. I guess we're just not the same as what we used to be when we were in uni. Yeah, it's such a weird, weird, sucky ass feeling. Well, look, if you like him, if you still like him, then just go for it. What about you? Don't you still have a thing for, you know, his... It's like someone found you after all. Well, I'll see you.
Holy shit, Mike, what the hell happened to you? My dog. My dog's collar. It was all covered in blood. It was in some container. Well, I'm seeing some crazy shit on my end. This game is fucked. I thought it was you. Or Scott trying to pull some sort of shit on me. Yeah. Someone's been pulling some real crazy shit on me earlier. I feel nauseous. And what did you see? I saw that guy. Yeah, that guy, that, that, that mute fella. Someone threw a fucking axe into his chest. Get the fuck out of here. Are you serious? Of course I am. Uh, there was nothing I could do. We should, uh, we should get back to the cabin. What about the fucking guy with the axe? He's out there. I haven't seen anyone else but you. There's someone's out there. You gotta believe me. Look at me. Right. Well, what do you reckon we should do instead, huh? We have to go back to the cabin anyway. Right? Right? So why don't we just head east? Hey, Scott. What? It's Scotty. Oh, my God. It's just you two. Are you okay? What the hell would happen to you? And you? What the hell happened to you? Oh, man. Long story. It's not my blood. What about you? I... I just saw Alice. You didn't happen to see who did it, did you, Scott? No, I just... I just saw it like this when I arrived. Did you guys happen to see anyone lurking in the woods during the game? I haven't seen anyone. Yeah, I, I saw someone. It was that guy with the fucking axe. Like I told Tim. Have either of you seen Arlene or Andrew? No. No. I mean, maybe... Maybe they're gonna be okay. Don't you think we should bury her or something? Right now, we need to get back to find the other girls. I mean, no disrespect to Alice, or, of course. Well, where do we start? Follow the compass to the lake. Like they said. Come on, we gotta go. That's how we reached the cabin. I mean, this could take all day for all we know. Hey, look. There they are. Oh. Okay. Is that them? I think it's them. It's all right. Come on. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yes, what happened? I think. What happened to both of you? So I broke into our cabin and fucking attacked us. He had a knife. What? I don't know where he is. He could still be under us, but I don't know. I don't know. I think I saw the guy that you referred to. Yeah. Guys, have you seen Alice? Uh, um, first things first, if, if what you say is true, then we need to get away from this lake. We, we need to get out of sight. Okay, come on, you're right, Tim. Let's go. We have to get out of play for you guys. Come on. We've got to go now. Come on. Are you sure, Scott? That's what happened? That's what you saw? Yeah. I couldn't believe it myself. She's already dying. Who's <laughs> this guy? What does he want? Why is he after us? I figured he's just some wacko looking for thrills. Yeah, well, this fucking wacko sure knows quite a bit about me. Are you sure? Are you sure it was your dog? Yes, I'm sure. Very sure. What I want to know is, who kept our damn phones? Oh, shit. It was Alice. I, I didn't see a bag when I found her. We left ours at the cabin. That means that this fucking wacko not only has both our phones, but he's got our car keys as well. <laughs> this, this is so fucked. 
place. I found this phone. Among the clues that your girls left. We didn't leave a phone. That wasn't part of our stuff. That guy must have left it. I mean, it's locked. It needs a passcode. I don't know. Hang on. I think I do. I found this. Okay, um, just enter the passcode and let's just see what happens. Yeah? There's, there's no two ways about it then. Oh my god, that's Eddie! I've done something really terrible. This fucking guy even knew about Eddie as well. And I thought I should let you know before I before I go. It's no secret. I've tried many times with you guys. Open for some that comes easy, but for others, you try, you just can't get it on. What the fuck's he babbling on? Shush. So, one night I went to this pub, I met this guy, he was a hired man for any favors. Even killing. I told him about you guys. About the trip. He knows everything. And I paid him in full for the job. But the next day, I started having second thoughts. Probably because I sobered up. I tried to call it off, but... He said he always finishes once he's been paid. And he did this to me. Oh my God. He's recording this right now. He's a sick fuck. Get out. Whatever you do, get the hell out of that place. Go. A fucking hired psychopath. All because of Eddie. Uh, I don't get it. Could he think of doing this to us? We're far from perfect, but it doesn't mean we deserve it. Uh, I don't get it. How, how did this guy even know this much about us? He was with us since college, man. Well, fuck it, I didn't know him that well. Well, it was just because we shared a table. Uh, we're all on social media. He could have seen a lot there and then showed it to this fucking guy, whoever he is. There's something I left out about Eddie back at the hospital. There's more you didn't tell us? I, I, I didn't want to ruin the fun or spoil the trip. What? What is it? Uh, the doctor also said Eddie's parents died in a car accident. <laughs> he was the only one that survived. Why didn't anybody tell us about this? I guess this shows how much we've been keeping in touch with him. <laughs> Guys, there's nothing that we can do for him or Alice. Wait, we need to get the hell out of here. Now. Oh, fuck. oh Mike, it's a long way back and we don't even know where we are now. I've got a rough idea of where we are. I can't get that far into circles, Mike. All right, fine, then... Scott, you look after the girls and me and Tim will go. Whoa, 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 what? whoa. You're gonna leave us. That's assuming the cars are even still there. He could have moved them, he could have done anything. He's right, Mike. Can't take that chance. We've got to do something. No, I'll go back to the cabin and get those two caretakers and. I don't know, then 
it. I'll bring him back here. We'll come back for you guys. Just assume me they're not dead already. I can't understand if you, if you guys don't want to come. If you don't want to come, then fine. Stay. But right now, I'm going. I'm going. Now. Wait, Mike, wait, Mike, wait, what the wait. fuck? You two want to go after him? Too strong up for this right now. <laughs> I'm sorry. Tim, <laughs> you have to go after him. We'll be fine, okay? We're here with Scott. Are you sure? Mike's on his own out there. Well, maybe he deserves All it. All right! He is still one of us, Tim. It doesn't matter how much of an asshole he is. Back for you guys, okay? Hey! Get bloody kid! Come and help me! Come on! The girls thought two guys would have better chance of getting help. Man, I don't intend on going back for them. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to get the cars and then I'm gonna drive to the nearest service station. Hey, fuck it, they can handle the rest. Well, that would take way too long. Something could happen. You still don't get it, do you? All this time, I, I was only ever after a quick one. What? With either of the girls? Is that all this has been about? I think things aren't what they used to be. Can't you feel that in amongst a group? And a quick one was all you could think about. Listen, I didn't fucking deserve all this, all right? I didn't cause it. I'm trying to deal with it. If you were smart, you'd come with us. We've got a better chance than them now. Can't you see that? I can't do that, Mike. I can't. I won't. Fine. Guys, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry that this trip is just not what we thought it would be. None of us saw this shit coming. How's your leg? It's numb. Cold. I think I've lost a lot of blood. Did you hear that? I, I think he came from over there. Shh, shh. No, did you hear it? Listen. The fire. Shh, shh. I think I see something. It looks like my car keys. How can you see that far? Uh, kind of. I, I gotta go check it out. No, 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 no. You stay here. You stay here with Abby. Are you sure? Yeah, I'll go. I'll be alright. Can you reach them? Yeah, they're just above my head. Got him. Behind you! <laughs> Get out of here! 
Something's killing me. I can't go any further. Please, 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 please. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. I need you to look at me, Ali. I need you to help me. Do you understand, Ali? Look at me. I understand that you have a better chance than me. Go! I'll hold him off. I'll hold him off. Go! <laughs> What happened? What happened? We need to go. We need to go. Mark, I did this. I did this when we set it up so that I knew that if I got lost to come back here. So? Well, it means that the the cabin, it's it's further that way. Alright. Let's go. Oh. 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 God, it's just you two. Scott, why did he let you go? I don't know. He could have killed me, but he didn't. What is it that you're not telling us, Scott? Have you met this guy before or something? Hang on, easy with that. Have you? Have you met him before? Answer me, God damn it! Why my fucking life? You don't know anything. I know nothing about this crazy guy, alright? Maybe it's just a trick. To make us fight each other. Why? What for? I don't know. So we separate again? Maybe? Look, Andrea knows where the cabin is, all right? Let's just go there and figure this shit out. Where's the cars? Fuck! What the fuck? Okay, come on guys, we're close. Guys.
off with no, it. No, shush! Fuck! Why did you do this? <laughs> to get you all worked up about me? <laughs> I was there. Watching. Saw the looks on all your faces. It was a great feeling. Seeing how I affected you guys. about me. <laughs> <laughs> I was with it, you crazy fuck. Oh, it was. After all those years, you guys left me out. <laughs> He was about to explain me and him. going after the guns, <laughs> jumping at whoever you wanted, and for what? For kicks? For thrills? <laughs> and for fucking around? You never let anyone else have a chance. That's why we planned this game. That's why we organized this trip. God, I was dead. You let him die. Oh, I didn't want to at first. Once we're done with all of you, I'll be right back to where I started. All alone. So I thought... Why not get something out of it? Thank you. She'll think I'm a hero. And see me in an entirely new light with no one like you to get in the way.
Jadi ya. Aduh, Itu didn't like. Great kill. Listen to me. Listen to me. Distant from me, Tim. What do you mean? The battery died. Well, that's why I didn't tell you about it. We had to refine it.
What happened? <laughs> Something really terrible has happened. I need to get back into town. It's okay. I'll help you. Put the arm on my shoulder. Okay? <laughs> Looks like you need a lift. Up in the back. On your mate. Whatever you do, get the hell out of that place. Ha <laughs> ha. 